Hello friends, we're Jake and Emily, the two roaming souls. This week, we're so excited to hit the road again in our tiny home on wheels. We're headed up Highway 1 in California to explore the North Coast. The massive redwood forests and salty coastal air is the perfect way to kick off the summer. So let's go. Good morning, everyone. Today is a big day for us. We're getting back on the road. Yeah, the past like two months or so, we've been like living in houses. Yeah. <laughs> amongst our family members. <laughs> we pretty much had the van parked at my brother's house like since March. Cause we like came here and then we went to Hawaii and then we went to the Midwest for like a whole month. So we really haven't been like in the camper van much. Uh, so we're excited to get back on the road. The first adventure is getting out of this driveway. <laughs> San Francisco we're about to yeah never fun to drive our huge vehicle in San Francisco but it's a very beautiful city yeah and then we're gonna hit a few spots along the like the coast and then head up to toward Eureka Eureka Urethra <laughs> We just a little, made a little pit stop. We're uh, kind of cutting towards the ocean and there's like this redwood forest over here. And it's beautiful. Yeah, so we found a little like path that we might be able to walk down and stretch the legs. Because I forgot how tiring driving can be. <laughs> yeah. And I'm not even driving. We're not just to become so beautiful out here there's like all these clovers and ferns on the ground and obviously giant redwood trees We are in Fort Bragg, California, and there's a famous beach here called Glass Beach. It's got all kinds of sea glass. So we're heading out there to check it out with a little bit of a picnic. It's beautiful.
That's a gorgeous beach. That's a little underwhelming, I would say. Yeah, not not an incredible amount of sea glass. And I'm from New England, so it's not my first time seeing sea glass, but still really nice and huge waves coming in, yeah. crashing on the rocks. We uh we're hoping to drive like another what we didn't know was like three and a half hours today. We've already driven like four or something. Yeah. So I don't know, we're gonna regroup, figure out where we wanna camp tonight and then make a plan. <laughs> I'm mad that I peed on my pants. <laughs> <laughs> can I explain? Yeah, you can explain. Talk to the camera. <laughs> so usually when we go to the bathroom, it's in like a public spot. So I was trying to hover over the bathroom or like the toilet and I peed on my leg. <laughs> We're a little out of practice. We've been, uh, what's the opposite of house broken? I don't know. Anyway, we need to get van life broken again so we can <laughs> stop peeing on ourselves. So we decided to skip the three hour drive. Seemed a little long for the day, so we ended up at a brewery instead. <laughs> we talked about being like more, uh, discipline when we hit the road again but literally first day we're like let's go to a brewery so we're here at North Coast Brewery and we're gonna check it out I think it's gonna be good you are bringing all the rules we shouldn't drink and we shouldn't get any food and we, are, we got a cup of clam chowder on the way well people like to have New England style clam chowder so I gotta see if they're lying to the rest of the world Pretty good. found this really cool beach on the side of the road. Um, it's on our way to the campsite and I think we're gonna have a fun little photo shoot. Kind of just relax and then we'll head towards camp. So let's have some fun. have everything like kind of lined up it will take longer but with Jake it will take exceptionally longer gotta stop it everyone
morning everyone. We just got back on the road. We are headed back up the highway, um, but the highway one kind of veers off from the coast today. So we're heading back towards the redwood trees and heading towards the Avenue of the Giants. We're really excited. All right, so we just got to Avenue of the Giants. It's like a place where the redwood trees are like growing right along the road. Some of them are like 370 feet tall. So this should be wild. Let's go check it out. Alright, so we just got to the Sequoia Park Zoo. We're gonna check out the Skywalk and kind of take a tour of the zoo, kind of. Yeah, there's this like elevated Skywalk that goes like up into the tree canopy and it's really cool. Oh, look, flamingo. I'm honestly like not that too psyched about zoos, but they have red pandas here. I'm pretty, pretty jazzed up about it. I think the red pandas are napping. Huge letdown. <laughs> face on that pig was hilarious. <laughs> All right, so we left the zoo and uh, it was really sweet. It's like 24 bucks for adults, 25 bucks. I think it's worth it. Yeah. And, like you get to go to the zoo too if you want to and they had some pretty cool animals. Yeah. <laughs> but for us, it was all about the skywalk. That was really cool. But we also saw some paths like kind of walking around underneath it. And it's not really part of the zoo. It's just like the park here, Sequoia Park. And um, so we're gonna go check it out from underneath. But this park is in beautiful. Like, it's very peaceful. If this was like, your city park, you'd be psyched. Yeah, definitely. All right, thanks for coming along on this adventure with us. First time back in our camper van this summer. We hope you enjoyed the redwoods and going up Highway 1. The views up here are always just mind blowing. So don't forget to subscribe because we have tons more adventures coming your way this summer. Yeah. We're excited to take you along. We're going up to Oregon and Washington and we're gonna keep making more videos and exploring. And don't forget to check out our blog, tworoamingsouls.com. Got all kinds of content about van life, hiking, camping, all the stuff we love. Yes. <laughs> all right, we'll see you next time. Bye. Does this count as uh, one or two? <laughs> <laughs> What'd you find? An Easter egg. There's nothing in it though. Ah, Rude. What a what a ripoff. <laughs>